I saw this gray looking thing. I couldn't really identify what it was. He was just rubbing himself with his head and neck on the street to itch himself. I got closer and then I was like, I can't, I can't even believe he's still walking. That skin was like a dinosaur, it was like stone. The pain that he must have been in, I was like, how are you just walking on this road? Luckily I had food with me because I was actually trying to catch another dog. He was so hungry and I was like, oh, you're gonna be an easy catch. But then he was like, no, no, no. He immediately backed off. It was actually my birthday. I put down a cage, I put down the food, and I was like, I want one present, and that is to get you to a vet clinic. Oh and we made it, we actually made it. We go now, yeah? Even considering in what kind of bad shape he was, he was strong. It took really quite a while for him to be stable enough to leave the clinic. So I just went to the pet shop and I got my sweet boy some toys and I will surprise him with treats and toys now. Hi, Jackie. Jackie, Jackie. Hello. Hello. Jackie. Hello. Hello. No. Oh. He doesn't leave the house anymore because he's like, no, now I'm staying here. So he sits down with his family and yeah, enjoys life with them now. Hello. His skin is actually healthy, beautiful. Like he looks amazing. Look at your little, huh? Look at your little thing. Oh, I love you too, yeah. I regularly visit them when I'm there. He's really, really happy. It was like a really nice start to my birthday and I was like, thank you. This was the best gift. I'll see you soon. Hmm? Yeah, I <laughs> Okay, you want the treat? Yeah, Pa. Oh yeah. Always treats first, no? Okay, <laughs> okay,